Arrows. I'm Kashan and you are watching The Book Archer. So today I am doing a tag video. Woo -woo. Okay, I'm excited because I got tagged by Books and Big Hair, which is my bestie. Hey girl. And she tagged me to do the booktube newbie tag. With, and I can't wait to answer these questions. So we're going to jump right into it. Question numero uno, why did you start this channel? Well, obviously I love books. That's everybody's number one answer for starting a booktube channel. However, I really do love YouTube and I definitely love sharing my opinions on things. I love being a part of the conversation. Naturally, I am definitely a very opinionated individual and I think that I'm very good at listening to how what other people think and then kind of, you know, processing that and like, okay, I understand multiple perspectives. So I'm like, well, why not start my own booktube channel where I can share books that I like, where I can share other perspectives and things like that. I just wanted to get more involved in the community in an active way because I really want to connect to other people who read. Aside from my best friend, there are not a lot of people I know who even read on the regular and I definitely, before I found booktube, I felt like I was the only person that was even into reading. I'm like, okay, this, this must be a weird thing. A lot of people don't read anymore. But booktube showed me that that's not true. So then, you know, why not share all of my reading and book related thoughts with you guys. So that's my reason for joining book two. Question two, what are some fun and unique things you can bring to booktube? One of the things I love about booktube versus like the beauty community, the difference is the booktube community is not as saturated as like beauty channels. So on beauty channels, you've basically seen it all, done it all for the most part, but there's still a lot of ground that hasn't necessarily been covered over here. So there is still such thing as new ideas and new elements that I can bring with my channel. I definitely have a lot of different likes and stuff as far as it comes to books. So I can add multiple perspectives for that. I definitely have tag and video ideas. So I will definitely be creating new tags and I will definitely be creating other videos that aren't necessarily book reviews and wrap ups and stuff like that because I already have ideas that I want to do. You can definitely look out for a variety like the more and more I do booktube when I'm comfortable enough to like branch out into that but I already have like ideas that I want to do. What are you most excited about for this channel? Definitely connecting with other booktubers and other readers. I really love how friendly the booktube community is. I love when people comment who aren't, you know, not necessarily booktubers, but you know, you watch booktube and you're reading books. I love discussing the books and the plot lines because a lot of times when you're watching TV shows, I love live tweeting during TV shows. So like if I'm watching one of my favorite shows and everybody's watching The Walking Dead or Game of Thrones and Scandal or Vampire Diaries like all at the same time, it's like we're tweeting each other. You're getting to see like those reactions. But with books, it's like, okay, I don't know who's reading what. So if I'm posting a video about books that I like or something I didn't dis or I disliked, then people who are commenting who, you know, they can interact with me the same way that I would when I'm like live tweeting a show. So that's what I'm most looking forward to. Why do you love reading? I love reading because it just provides you with another element outside of yourself. A lot of times reading for me is like my me time. I definitely believe in having like your personal time, your me time, especially since there's just always so much going on for me personally. So it's like my time where I just get to be by myself and engulfed in the story. I don't have to be worried about my problems. It's just me like involved with the story. And obviously since I'm a writer, well, not obviously, but I am, I'm a writer. Naturally, I'm, I am a fan of storytelling in general, whether it be in journalism with real world people or whether it be in books, just because creating like a book out of thin air, it's like, it's, it's crazy. The, the options are endless. You can literally read about anything because you can write about anything. And people create like these whole worlds. So that's why I love reading because you never know what you're going to get. What book or book series got you into reading? I would say I've literally been reading since I could read, like since I was little, like since Dr. Seuss and stuff. And when I was in like elementary school, of course, American Girls. And I used to love the mystery series, like the box boxcar kids. Oh my goodness, I used to read those down. But of course, 
everybody knows the goat is Harry Potter. Like I grew up on Harry Potter. If you didn't grow up like on Harry Potter, then you don't understand that Harry Potter was a phenomenon that was beyond people that read. There were literally people who I know who did not read and they would read like a seven page, they would read like a 500, 700 page Harry Potter book like it was nothing. And that's when I was like, oh, I'm die hard. Cause I, I, I loved Harry Potter, I loved it. Oh. What questions would you ask your favorite booktuber? What else do they want to do? that involves with like reading and stuff. I guess like their career goals and stuff. Are they interested in publishing? Are they interested in writing? Because I always wonder if certain booktubers I watch want to be authors. And especially for some of the older booktubers, like what made you decide to make your channel? Because I remember the first booktuber I ever watched was um, The Little Book Owl. I was like searching a series and I found like booktube, that's how I found booktube through The Little Book Owl. But her channel is like super old to me. So I just want to know like, how did you, what made you decide, you know, I'm going to make book videos when there weren't a lot of people out there doing it. I definitely would love to talk to the pioneers because you're the first. What challenges do you think starting a booktube channel will be the hardest to overcome? I just want to be able to do book reviews as well because books, I, when I do book reviews, it's like I just tend to ramble on. So I definitely think that's going to be difficult for me to figure out how to do those reviews without rambling and rambling. And rambling. That's the end of the booktube um, newbie tag. If you have any more questions for me please feel free to ask them or anything like that. I'm super friendly. I comment back on everybody's videos. I'll go check out your page like whatever. And yeah thank you for checking out this video. I really really appreciate it. Since you see this tag you know I'm a new booktuber and you have blessed me with engaging you for the last few minutes and I really appreciate that. All right, so I hope y'all have a great day. This is Kashan, the book archer, signing off. Bye.